Well, that was certainly a song uh, not really up and hip and happening with what you like, but I'm sure it's really nice. I won't be the first to say I'm, I'm not very fashionable. In fact, if I did, I would be the 27th person to point out that what I'm wearing is so dated that it will, it will never be found ironically cool and it's immune to retro influence even if my wardrobe was the only clothes left in the whole world. Uh, it's quite a long worded insult, but never mind. Fortunately, I'm joined now, right now, right now. It's hip and happening right now. Joined by Wandsworth's own fashion expert, and you won't mind me saying this, this, uh, Natalie Chains. Good morning. Uh, so, is, is that what we're all saying now? Good morning? Yes, but only when holding this tiny golf umbrella in your mouth. Oh, right, hang on. I just would warm them. Oh, no. Oh, oh dear, no, no. Oh. It's a good effort, but no. But I, I've often wondered, like, who decides when something uh, cool goes off? You know, like when flares went out of fashion in the 80s, but then briefly came back in 1990. Well, I don't know. I wasn't born then. Fashion is the now, not the past. What about retro? Retro so last week, according to the Great Wheel. The Great Whale? No, my MB Barbie fashion wheel. My tracing skills are well lush. But the fashion wheel, it's, it's my fashion design studio. Mm-hmm. All you have to do is turn the wheel on the fashion design studio unit to select the hairstyles and clothes, and then turn again to select from the different fabric textures and patterns. I got with my money my aunt gave me after she encountered that steamroller. So whatever we wear is at the whims of you. Mm-hmm. At a loss of what to do when the crayons run out. Phew, mm-hmm. wow. I'm, I mean, I, I was always, I kind of suspected that there was some kind of alien conspiracy, you know, like, like in They Live. You know, only the cool shades don't free your mind, they, they trap your body. <laughs> yeah, you realised all the listeners are on the verge of turning off because you've gone all uh, sci-fi. Yeah, I've often wondered that. Also, a lot of wondering today why certain people, you know, sometimes women, phase out when sci-fi is mentioned. Wake up! Almost as if, like, ladies are controlled by an entity that uses psychic shielding that cuts out mental interest if you even hint at Star Trek. Boring. No, 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 wait, wait, I'm onto something. What if, what if, this is deliberate, that sci-fi is deemed geeky, but only by secret overlords who know that sci-fi actually tells the truth, that we are in the grip of, um... Oh, nice. Are they they new shoes? Mm -hmm. No, no, wait, it's got me. No, no, I must fight the urge to ask you where you bought them. Oh, well, I picked these up in Wandsworth. From a bin? No. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Fashion is never funny. Maybe, maybe I'm onto something again. Sci-fi references, wacky puns are never in or fashionable or groovy, right? Then there must be a conspiracy that that only puns and Star Trek uh, in-jokes can uncover. Well, I've got a bad bad feeling about this. Yeah, yeah, you see, you paraphrased something from Star Wars there, you just made a quip relating to episode four. We're combining sci-fi and jokes, you will soon be free of fashion. Comedy was the new rock and roll. But I like shoes, I really like shoes. No, 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 but you don't, that's how they've got you, come on. But you mean if I abandon Dolce and Gabbana, Heavy Echo, John Paul Gaultier and Georgia Asda, I'll be free Mm. and able to embrace life outside of control and be my own being, a pure individual spirit able to consume and let intellectual pursuits and enjoy Star Wars Force Awakens, but then tear it to pieces online a month later? Yeah. But what will I wear? This exclusive Red Dwarf Season 12 t-shirt. Oh, ooh. But, but it comes complete with a Tim Vine joke book. You mean I gain my soul, but lose my MB Barbie fashion wheel? But, but, but don't you realise fashion is fickle? Finite, it fades, but a joke is forever. Mm. The, the, the story of rebels versus a corrupt evil empire in space is it, so much like real life. You know, the, the everyman versus the man. Yes, but what is this man wearing? Being he's a shadowy figure, I think dark pastel shades and some hipster cords and a, a light trim beard like the master in the Doctor Who in the 80s. Yeah, see, see, look, sci-fi, there, like, you're fighting to be free of it's it. It's too late for me. Oh. But Elliot, you keep being uncool and hopeless and rubbish. It's, oh. it's the only freedom right now. I'm off to the nearest shoe shop for a fitting and a fix. May the force be with you, whatever that means. Right, let's see what's out there. Engage. Some fashions are out of this world. And punchlines are never cool, are they? Mm. Or are they?